My name is uh, George Scharpenack and I'm the CEO and owner of Ulbricht's Protection. We develop and produce helmets with the best protection against bullet threats. It's an Austrian company. We are uh, that small country in the Alps, in the center of Europe, and we focus on producing these helmets. We present two helmets. One we call the first responder helmet, which is uh, this helmet. It's a very light helmet and it uh, truly protects against handgun ammunition. It also protects against Kalashnikov ammunition like the 7662 uh, steel core or the 0223 or even the 308 ammunition shot by rifle. Is that rifle helmet we just recently approved in our laboratory. It's able to stop Kalashnikov and 308 and even is uh, capable in reducing the back face deformation to below 25 joule, even when shot by Kalashnikov steel core. True protection against bullets is achieved if two things happen. The first thing, of course, you have to stop the bullet. But the second thing is a helmet has to prevent a severe back face deformation that would lead to a lethal brain trauma. And that we try to explain and show here because many, many people don't know about this effect, but it's so important. We shot on two kind of helmets, one on a regular NIJ3A helmet made of a composite material. You get that kind of deformation, which is absolutely lethal. And we shot on a Ulbricht first responder helmet and you get that kind of deformation, which is a pretty strong headache, but is completely survivable. So that is what we call true protection, because you don't have to stop the bullet but you have to reduce the back face deformation to, to survivable limits. Here we shot one AK-47 steel core on a NIJ-3A composite helmet and the bullet completely penetrates the helmet and the head. Many, many people don't know that normal military and police helmet don't protect against rifle ammunition because they even cannot stop them. We shoot like the specification requires from 10 meters with vertical angle and with full velocity. We shoot M80 with full velocity and we shoot AK-47 with full velocity. You see that little dent, we not only stop the bullet, the AK-47 steel core, but we reduce the kinetic energy below 25 Joule. In other words, our helmets have uh, shot by, by Kalashnikov have less back face deformation than standard helmet half when shot with 9mm handgun ammunition. And that's really the, the news for that trade show. Millipool is one of the major international and of course European trade shows. And after the Corona, for us it's one of the first shows where people come around the world. So we are very happy here and we have lots of talkings and, and communication with our customers. We supplied our Centurio helmets to nearly all European SWAT teams since decades. So we're number one supplier for ballistic helmets for SWAT teams. But additionally, we won the majority of first responder tenders in Europe for the, for the police and patrol. The police and patrol is always the first in scene and they definitely need the same protection. So we won most of the tenders for them too. Well, the biggest motivation for us is really to protect those who protect us and to save lives. That's our motivation.